online shopping has been probably the biggest thing nowadays. Um, not many people are going in stores, but there's yep. a lot of safety concerns with online shopping. Um, let's address those first. Sure, absolutely. I know a lot of people do get uh, a little bit nervous when they're when they're thinking about shopping online. But one of the things that they want to look for when they go to the website, if they look in the address bar, there should be a little lock in the address bar. It looks just like it's just a little icon of a lock. If there's a lock up there, that means it's a secure site and that it's probably okay for you to, to enter in your credit card information into that site. Also, in the address bar, if the address is HTTPS, that S on the end actually stands for secure. So that's something that you can look for as well to know that you know it's a relatively safe site for you to actually make a donation on. A little, a little peace of mind for if you're shopping online. Anything else? Um, what kind of things do you guys see like um, I know the convenience convenience factors there putting your credit card in and leaving it in all these accounts what kind of things what advice do you have for people for that kind of thing well just again make sure that you know the the site is secure before you do that if you have any um, any intuition that it's not secure, don't enter your information in there also um, when you're out shopping you know it's sometimes um, convenient to go to McDonald's and do some of your shopping while you're sitting there. Just know that a lot of times those are open Wi-Fi networks and there may be a hacker sitting somewhere inside that um, that establishment that may be able to really? tap into your stuff. So yeah, be careful when you're, when you're using that. If you have access to a, a VPN, which is a virtual private network, um, use that. Otherwise, just wait till you get home to do your holiday shopping and entering your credit card information in. 